just about every shot he hit with this club yesterday was 150% commitment. Good start, my leader. over his playing partner Campio in terms of putts per greens in regulation, the Odyssey putting stats. Pulls them all the back of that green. They, they all think there's break there and it's incredibly flat. To step on it. It's an excellent view from behind where that flag is. And he's, that's going to be a difficult one down from there. Very little green to work with for Hovland. That's just a sign of the warm conditions. Ball flying a bit further. Yeah, I think he was caught between shots there, wasn't he? He's been holding these with... Well, great regularity. You see from the graphic, quite a few players have had a go at this green. Nice big shot of four, good to hear. But is the ball okay? There's a ditch over there, there's a couple of trees there. There it is in the bunker. That means an awkward long range bunker shot, but certainly doable. Execution is everything. Reach the green, it should release nicely. Wonderfully done, wasn't it? Aggressive, off the down slope. 187 in, into the breeze, pin right at the back of the green, 36 on. Sky oh, is drifting right. Just okay. play that well. He could have got the putter to it, possibly. <laughs> 15 feet past the hole would be a great result. Can't blame any player for going long with that flag position, can you? Good tee shot, clever second shot to here needs to get the pace spot on and he's left himself another one of those that are certainly no gimme just a little bit of break in this for Hovland oh, he just pushed that just there straight through it was just right half the hole well now Hovland here stepping on one not this soft dog leg like you said 424 yards part four yeah. I've seen it. Yeah, excellent tee shot from Hovland. Driver's not the problem. Needs to get that part of working, Hovland. He's not quite sticking his irons in as close as he did yesterday either, is he, Victor Hovland, so far? This is the strength of his game. Time to take control now. I think this is the point where he eases back ahead. A little bit uphill as well, this one, Dom. So, yeah, all the advantages. He's got to be nice and clear-minded with this one. Knock it in. You never know what might happen. Yeah. Yes, big putt. Huge putt. He's been patient. He's been the epitome of patience. And he's finally got his lead back. 
He struggled around the greens today. Hovland. Plenty of loft in his hand here. Yeah, not his best, was it? Putting himself under pressure today, Hovland. Huge putt. Hold a good one on the last for birdie. This for par, same length, and it's straight. Well done. He's found his putter just when he needed it. Well, he's not laying up with that, is he? Three wood aiming down the right. He's trying to get it back right of the green here. Flag front left. Does he come over there a bit? Long's not good. It's better than being short, Mike. That is not an easy chip from there. He takes it on, doesn't he? not being comfy on these all day. Can he find one now? Landed it softly, didn't he? That's a beauty. That's the best of the day, for sure. At the right time as well. And Victor Hovland moves too clear of Martin Keimer with two holes to play. Six iron, 221 yards to cover. That's in the heart of the green. That's exactly what he needed to do. Game on still, I'd say. Martin Keimer will be watching somewhere, that's for sure. But you can bail out right off this dog leg, par five right to left, water bearing on the left hand side if you slightly bite off a bit more than you can chew. He hit it in the right bunker yesterday, he has the length to reach them. Oh, it's perfect now. Did he take a bit off that for the first time this week, Jamie? Yeah, 258, and the biggest bailout in the world is left. You've got the big marquee. We've seen Wiesberger over there. There's a few drop zones that you can take. You can play well away from the water. But the thing is, the breeze is slightly into his face, and that water's lurking. Perfect shot from Victor Hovland. And that'll do it. Brilliant shot, that. The element of youth, Jamie. Element of youth just going straight at the middle of the green. No questions asked. Great shot into the last. Now then, three putts to win. You'd rather have two. Victor Hovland for a closing birdie. And a round of 70 to take the BMW International Open. He's a history maker. The first Norwegian to win on the PGA Tour becomes the first Norwegian to win on the European Tour as well. It is a two-shot win over Martin Palmer for the 23-year-old Victor Hovland. Victor, many, many congratulations. The first Norwegian to win on the European Tour. How special is this moment? 
Yeah, I'm kind of glad it's over. It's uh, it was uh, it was a long day. It was very stressful, but uh, um, yeah, it feels great, and and uh, it'll be nice to relax for a couple of weeks now. You started the day three ahead, but uh, Martin Karmi shot 64 to post 17 under as a target when you stood on the 13th tee. Just tell us about those last few holes and what you felt were the most significant moments. Yeah, I, I saw he was uh, he was creeping from behind, and and uh, Jorge was hanging on, and and uh, I mean the. After missing a bunch of putts, uh, making the birdie on 13 helped a lot, um, and then the par save on on 14 that was uh, that was big for momentum. And then after that, I just try to you know play pretty solid golf, not make too many mistakes, and uh, had a three putt on 17, but um, you know great birdie on on 16 and 18. So um, yeah, it was good enough today. Many people might have hit it in that hospitality than the 18th. You hit it right in the heart of the green. You just don't have any backup in you, do you? Uh, I, I was aiming at that car, but uh, <laughs> pushed it a little bit and ended up perfect. So uh, we'll take it. Your next start, I understand, is going to be the Open Championship. Obviously, you're now virtually confirmed in the Ryder Cup team if, if you get picked, if you had any sort of problem. So you're there, you're up to 13th in the world, a career high. With this confidence boost going into the Open, how much are you looking forward to that? Yeah, I mean, first of all, I'm looking forward to a couple of weeks at home in Norway just to just relax and see all my friends. And um, I mean, it's the Open, Olympics, uh, Ryder Cup. I mean, there's there's so much golf to look forward to. and. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to have a blast. Many, many congratulations. Great playing. Well done. Thank you. Appreciate it. To watch another European Tour video, click here. And to subscribe, click here.